know the way I feel. You got me losing my mind. Oh, try to suppress my emotions. They're bursting like fountains, baby. They take me up, they take me down. I'm getting weak on my knees. Introducing Zakia Loves Pinto. Hey, let's go. We're running late. I think it would be the same if it was called Keeping Up with the Jenners? No. Hell no. You don't think it'll hit the same? Hell no. The Kardashians are a brand. Like, this is a brand that was built on the back. Of Kim Kardashian. I'm sorry. The Jenners, keeping up with the Jenners, it just, it just doesn't match. I'm sorry. They have an empire built on the Kardashian name. It would not work in anything else other than in keeping up with the Kardashians. Sorry. It don't, it don't, it, it, it don't roll off your tongue the way it's supposed to. <laughs> when people name their kids, like just names that just don't flow together with their last name, that's All how right. that would be. It's like if my last name was Matthew. Candace Matthew totally fits. And if you don't know, my first name is Candace, actually. Everybody calls me Candace, but they just can't get it right. Candace Matthews? That's kind of sound cute. Oh, I'm not gonna tell her that. What you trying to say? Cause I'm my last saying. name is Matthews. I know, but now I'm That was shade. To... No, it was not. That was shade. That's it like if my name, last name was Pinto. No, but let's just Zakiya say- Zakia Pinto don't hit the same as Zakia Matthews. Yes, but my so does Matthews. It hits with my name as well. But calm down. <laughs> oh, lying man. Pinto always want to be sensitive. She is so sensitive. She says it's me, but she's actually the one that's very sensitive. And she be trying to play it off, throwing it onto me, but it's actually her. Okay, she's very, very, very sensitive. She's a she's a Pisces. Duh. I wonder, like, with the same people, Kim and everybody, if it was called Keeping Up With The Jenners, if they would get the same viewings. It really does matter. Like, Brandon has a lot to do with it, seriously. Is the KK keeping it? Oh, that sounds good. Don't say another K. <laughs> okay. But because they had did. two Ks keeping up with the Kardashians, it just really hits. Yeah. You know, like, uh, jumping with the Jenners. If we had a reality show, we would be called catching up with the pentos. It only makes sense. I love ketchup. So it's gonna be called catching up with the pentos. Kick. Is that a real name? No, if it was named because oh. it has two J's. Oh. Jamming oh. with the Jenners. Mm, that's Ooh, corny. Did I just spit? No, but that was corny. <laughs> no, I'm just saying yeah. like just something. Bruce what? I mean, Kaylin. <laughs> I don't want you. no problems. Okay, Kaylin would definitely choose jumping or jamming with the Jenners. Jamming with the Jenners, that would have been a good name. So what would our show be called? Pimping with the Pintos. <laughs> Let's go. Let's go. Pimping with the Pintos just, it feels right. I can't wait to be a Pinto because when we have our show, Pimping with the Pinto would totally be the name, okay? Pinto is like a name you don't even hear often. So it just feels right to be pimping. We gonna be match having matching outfits with their kids. It just makes sense. Well, Matthews dash Pinto. Then yours is gonna be Matthews dash Pinto. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. I'm not hesitant to having a hyphen as my last name as long as there is a compromise because if you're telling me that it only has to be one last name, well, baby, I'm gonna be Pinto all day. But sure, we can share a last name. Put that hyphen, put that pencil on the end. So you already know. You know, no, the thing is, is that I only had a problem when we had that conversation because you were like, no, why can't you have just have my last name? And yeah, why can't, I mean, but really, in okay, reality, that, why couldn't you just okay. have my last name? It's I okay, know. just yes, because you're on. Just your last name. You could, want, just the like same way that other people have to take other that's people's last like name. That's saying then you can propose to me then. Do I want to be proposed to? I wouldn't be mad, 
but I know she ain't gonna do it. <laughs> Look, it means more to her than it does to me, but I also feel like, hey, just because I'm masculine doesn't mean that I do not want to be proposed to. Like, cut that out. I, I don't like the double standard. I don't like it at all. So, um, you know, it could go either way. Well, I guess we'll just have to continue talking about it. And I can, if I want to. Exactly. But I don't want to. And, but I don't want to. There we go. But I think it's fair to have a hyphen name. I honestly, even in hetero relationships, I still think that, yeah, you, you take your husband's last name, but it wouldn't hurt to have both just to keep that legacy going on both ends. Because it's almost like as a woman, your name, your last name disappears after you get married. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, And does. so that legacy, like your father could be Martin Luther King, but then you marry somebody and his last name is Smith or something like that. And then, boom. No, no legacy. We gonna have to have a hyphen. It's gonna be Matthews Pinto. I feel like I love my last name. Who would I be if I wasn't a Matthews? Like my dad gave me that last name. So it's only right for our children to have that last name. Also, I'm not really close with my brothers and um, it's just important for my dad to, to see some Matthews little babies being brought up unless you know they have sons but if you're like the only child it's like dang how do you carry your name on as a woman you know you don't. You yeah don't. so I, I do but i know that a lot of men have problems with that and me being masculine presenting of course i can see why people would think that i would want to keep my last name but the real reason is because my brother is been nothing but girls so it is left up to me to keep this legacy going and I hope to have a son so that he carries on the Pinto last name. You know, my family is from Jamaica. We got a lot of history with that last name, you know, from the Maroons and it just from the Spaniards being in Jamaica and the Arawak Indians. It's just a lot that I want to teach him. And so uh, that is the main reason why I want to keep the last name. You know, I hold a lot of weight. Is this what Men and Boss feels like? I'm gonna need some help. Mommy, did you cry when the queen died? I'm totally indecisive. Even with my millions, they are brand built. Why is he on buying you up? Zakia is totally a drama queen. And slightly a hypochondriac too. Am I indecisive? Let's see. Okay. How was that? I don't, I can't pick between, uh, that thing. <laughs> <laughs> of course, who wouldn't want to be proposed to? You know, I'll just do it just, you know, I can tell the homies, you know, that <laughs> she put a ring on me. <laughs>